is Carolyn Molnar, and I have an extensive library of videos based on my followers' questions. Please send your questions on spirituality via my website, carolynmolnar.com, and if it helps many, it may appear on this channel. The answers are based on 40 years plus of experience as a psychic medium. Now, some of these topics you may not agree with, so please move on to the next. These clips are made for information only. So please sit back, relax, and enjoy. Thanks for watching. What is the difference between the souls or ghosts of people in the physical world and those who have crossed over? What's the difference when channeling? For me, I have to be in the area of where the ghosts appear. They are in that area. They don't tend to move around. Um, for instance, I had Mrs. McPherson in my home when I lived in Cape Breton all those years ago, and that's where she wanted to stay, in her home. You'll also find that historic places like Niagara-on-the-Lake in Canada or anywhere in England where there's hauntings, they are in the area where they were most affected, whether it's their homes, battlefield, uh, wherever their death occurred. Now with spirit, I can reach them anywhere, from anywhere. So I'll be giving a reading and I will um, call in a spirit person by their name and they, they would magically appear. The only time they don't is if A, they don't want to, uh, come. Uh, B, they're not well enough to come, and that's because their energy needs to be brought up because of illness, or they've reincarnated, so they're not available as the person you remember them to be. So ghosts are here and in the area. Spirit are free to be wherever. Mm -hmm.